In this guide, I'll show you how to fix slow downloads on your rogue Xbox Ally or Ally X. So the first thing I recommend you do is stand close to your router with your handheld so you're getting the best Wi-Fi connection. Now, if it's a lot slower than what it should be, you could try power cycling your home network by unplugging your modem and or router for 30 to 60 seconds, then plug it back in and wait for it to reboot, and then see if your downloads are faster. Now, another thing I recommend you do is actually just pause the download for a couple seconds and then restart it to see if the speed increases. Now, after you've done that, press the Xbox button, and we're gonna scroll over to settings at the top and scroll down. And where you see your Wi-Fi network, select it, and we're gonna go to more Wi-Fi settings. Now, that'll bring you to this page where what we're gonna do is navigate to your actual Wi-Fi. So scroll down until you get to this more option beside your Wi-Fi network. And then once you're in more Wi-Fi settings, scroll down and you wanna look for DNS server assignment and select edit. Now we're gonna change it from automatic to manual and then we're gonna turn on IPv4. Now under the preferred DNS is where we're gonna put in the primary DNS. And in this video, we're gonna use the Google DNS, which is a fast DNS server. So you wanna type in 8.8.8.8. .8 and after you've done that, you can go back and scroll down and under the alternate DNS is where you want to type in the secondary DNS. So for Google DNS, it's going to be 8.8.4.4. And if you want to try a different DNS, you can as well. So I'm going to go back now and we're going to save these settings at the bottom. And then with these custom DNS settings, see if your speed increases. If this guide was helpful, like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.